Kristen, I'm nervous standing here in front of you. Not nervous because I'm afraid or anxious, but because the day I declare my love for you and take your hand in marriage is a day I've wanted since the first time we met. Since our first date, life has been nothing short of amazing, but it's a future I see ahead of us that makes me the luckiest man on earth, not just for today, but for the rest of my life. When I look at you, I see the beautiful, kind, loving woman that every man hopes to find one day. There's a word that gets tossed around quite a bit. The word is soulmate. Whatever term you want to use, there's a person whose path crosses yours in life and you know they are just the perfect match for you. Then you start to develop this intuition. You think to yourself, okay, this one's different. There might be something here. Then it hits you. The voice in your head saying, this is the person I want to spend the rest of my life. Kristen and Austin are both fortunate as they have found that perfect match in each other. They met through mutual friends while in college. Their paths crossed on a few occasions. Unfortunately for our little groom here, he got stuck in the friend zone for some time. It took a while for him to develop the courage to take the leap and ask her out on a first date. And that being said, I think as we all stand here today, it's safe to say they both felt the spark that night. Austin, we've been in each other's lives for eight years now, but these last three and a half years we've spent together have been my favorite. We didn't have a traditional start to our story. You like to say that I friend zoned you. But I know that everything happens for a reason and I'm so thankful to be standing up here with you today. I believe our foundation of friendship helped us to build a strong and trusting relationship from the start. And we were only months into our relationship when I knew that you were the one for me. never felt so much love for one person before, and it was hard to put into words, but I knew that I wanted to marry you when you became my home. You're my best friend, my biggest supporter, and my favorite person on this planet. Austin, you and I both know that I'm terrible at making decisions, but deciding to marry you was the easiest and best decision that I ever made. As we continue to build in our love and our lives together, I vow to laugh with you, sing with you, cry with you, and grow with you. I vow to work together as a team because I know together we can do anything. And I vow to always date you and continue to put you in our relationship first. I love you so much, Austin. Thank you for being you and choosing to love me even when it isn't easy. I'm so excited to begin our life together as husband and wife, and I can't wait to spend the rest of my life loving you. It's you and me forever more. I wanna go do something kind of crazy. Drive on that with you right next to me. This is just kind of like a long winded way of showing that there was some force out there drawing them to each other. If Austin can get out of the friend zone, you guys can do anything. <laughs> so here's to the bride and groom. May you have a life full of happiness and beautiful babies. I want to run in wide spaces, fly like the wind in high places, rushing like water on my face with your hand in my head. Although in reality, you've been a member of 
of her family for at least like a couple years now. Kelly and I have been married for 33 years and we have three of the finest young men that a father and a mother could ever hope to have. Today, we welcome our first girl to the family. Yeah, I